Welcome back to the Lights Out podcast, bedtime stories for boys and girls around the world. Good evening, boys and girls. Are you ready for bed? Are you all snuggled up and ready for another Lights Out bedtime story? Well, you're in for a treat tonight, because tonight's story is called Oh No, George, by Chris Horton. And a big shout out goes to Finley and Aria from the UK. Thank you for downloading my free books on martinkennis.com. I hope you enjoy this story tonight. Once upon a time. Harris is going out. Will you be good, George? asks Harris. Yes, says George. I'll be very good. I hope I'll be good, George thinks. George sees something in the kitchen. It's a cake. I said I'd be good, George thinks. But I love cake. What will George do? Oh no, George. What has George seen now? It's a cat. I said I'd be good, George thinks. But I love to play with cats. What will George do? Oh no, George. What has George seen now? Some lovely soil. I said I'd be good. George thinks, but I love to dig soil. What will George do? Oh no, George! Harris is back. Hello, Harris. Great to see you. George, what have you done? You've ruined the place. And how on earth did you eat a whole cake? I said I'd be good, George thinks. I hoped I'd be good, but I wasn't. What will George do? I'm sorry, George says. I want to give you my favourite toy. Thank you, George, says Harris. Why don't we go out for a nice walk? Great. George loves to go out. There are so many things to see and do. Uh Uh-oh, George has seen a cake. Will he eat it? No, George goes straight past. Well done, George. George sees some lovely soil. Will you have a little dig? No. Well done, George. George doesn't even try to chase Cat. Even Cat is a bit surprised. Something smells very interesting. What can it be? It's a rubbish bin. There's nothing George likes more than rubbish. What will George do? George! The end of Oh No, George by Chris Horton. And that goes out to Finley and Aria. Good night.